Hey, what's up guys? I am Joe from Workbench, and we're gonna do a quick little text tutorial. So let's check it out. So as motion designers, we've all been asked at some point to make one of these double stack text price lockups. And they're always a pain because you could do them in a bunch of different layers, or you can do them in a bunch of lines. And then somebody changes something, you have to rearrange everything, and it's always just kind of a pain. So like somebody wants to make this dollar sign smaller and stack it up. And then you have to go and move all of these things around. But instead, there's a slightly easier way. And there are some issues with it, but it can help you do things a lot quicker. So let's just delete that. See, everybody always wants me to start fresh from something. So here we go. Join us. $5 a month per month. There you go. So let's take this and make it a little bit bigger. And we're going to select this, make it way bigger. I'm going to set this back to zero because that's 60 for some reason. Just going to push it down. There we go. So there's a little trick I discovered a little bit ago that maybe you know about, but I didn't realize was a thing. But uh, you can double click on here, select a block of text, and then open this up and add an animator with position. And that will select just this piece of text. Unfortunately, though, it's by character, not by word. So that would be extra helpful in this case. But now you can move this all over. And then we can go back, select just that spot, make a new position, move it all back over here, do the same thing on this side, add a position to the bottom one. How much did I move that down? 87. Just keep it consistent. We can move that down 87, move it over here. Till it's close. I'm not trying to be 100% perfect here. Select just this back end of text. Add a new animator. Move the position. Move it back. And now you have it set up. You can change things. Obviously, if you add another character, you're going to have to make things a little bit different here. So you can just go back through your animators. Go down to your range. And you're going to have to add like one to each one. Just hit up. Go down here. Add one to each one. But for that slight annoyance, it's a little easier than trying to rejigger the entire text all over again. All right, so that's it. I hope you guys can put that to good use. And if you're wondering why I say join us for $5 a month, it's because we pretty much opened up our Patreon all the way back into the back catalog of everything. All of our project files, all of our monthly files, R&D stuff, pretty much everything we've built over the last three years is up there for $5. So go check it out. Anyway, that's it. If you guys like to help support us in any other way, check out workbench.tv support. And as always, I'm Joe, and we'll see you next time. Bye.